I was just a little girl. I asked my mother, what will I be? Will I be pretty? Will I be rich? Here's what she said to me. Hey, We're going to Wembley. Hello everyone, we are concluding this incredible season in perfect style at Wembley. We got two finals today, we got Newport Pagnall against Mascot in the FA Vars final, followed by Halifax, hi Clive, followed by Halifax against Gateshead in the FA Trophy final. We've got Luciano, got Samardo, Ravenelli will be joining us sooner. How are we feeling boys? It's a good way to wrap up the season, isn't it? Lovely day. Lovely, but... Samardo? Say how you feel. Hungry. Oh, for God's sake. <laughs> Can't take him anywhere. I cannot wait. I think it's time we speak to some fans. I'm William Vale. And I'm Hayley. And we're from... Newport Pagnell. <laughs> and so you guys are the holders. Do you feel you can retain it today? Yes. Yes, I we're think good. we're good. We're the constant, aren't we? Fantastic. What's your score prediction then? Uh, I reckon it's going to be 3-1 Fantastic, that's the spirit. A lot of my subscribers want to know about non-need, so tell us, what are Newport Pagnall all about? Oh, it's all about family, community, from the young ones, the youth teams, all the way through to the first team. It's a real yeah. good community feel there, um, and as you can see, everyone's left Newport today and Milton Keynes to come and cheer on the Green Army. Yeah, it's amazing. Look at that. Look how many fans you got here. It's going to be some day. All right, we've got so much Scott fans here. How are you guys feeling about today? Good. Good, good. That's the spirit. Positive, yeah. yeah. And there's a lot of people like ground hoppers like myself who, like, if they want to visit Royal Ascot, they want to know all about the team. What Royal Ascot all about? <laughs> grassroots. They're literally from the bottom to, to the top. They're, uh, they're yeah. So we're grassroots coaches. So we have. Oh, fantastic. Yeah, they're, they're, they're huge yeah. in the grassroots bit. Um, but the team itself, all about teamwork and winning, and they love a comeback. So if we go down. Please don't expect us not to win, because yeah, we still up. will. Have the yellows! <laughs> <laughs> so, so you guys haven't won this competition before, what will it mean to you if you do win it? Everything. Oh, everything. everything. To the club, it'll mean everything. Fantastic. Well, what, finally, what are your predictions? Well, I hope it's not penalties. Three, <laughs> three, 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 I hope it's penalties. Um, but yeah, hopefully we can get through and get one point. Yeah, yeah. Hopefully we can get one point. Excellent. Let's hope one of you two has proven right. Yes, yeah. <laughs> Thank you, all the best. <laughs> it's a perfect way to wrap out this season. And on 50 games, this will make it 51 and 52. It's going to be amazing. Love coming to Wembley. So excited. Cheers. England legends. Got to be more. Oh, look at these skills. Oh, he shouldn't be a steward. Oh, around the world. Right, it is time to go inside Wembley for two cup finals. Let's do this. On the way to our seats, we assembled the cross. Wembley Museum. Not bad. Nice. A week ago, I was in the San Siro. Today, at Wembley. This is brilliant. For only 25 quid, we're in the fancy seats of that. Padded seating at Wembley. I'm living like a king. How are we feeling, boys? Still hungry. Let's make some noise! Woo! The party's complete, Ravenelli! Yay! We've got all four of us. Woo! It's got a nice roast vegetable pasty here. Only five quid. Nice edgy option. Delicious. Nice and hot. Can't go wrong with it. Fair play. That's good stuff. Considered I've been to Milan this week. I've got high standards of food. This is not disappointed. Luke, what you got? Hi. Steak and ale. Steak and ale indeed. Enjoy. I'm debating whether to get gin and tonic now. Am I going to be the person that drinks a gin at a football match? We'll see. <laughs> what have we got here? Tomato? Hi. Steak chocolate. and ale. Oh, it had to be a hot chocolate. Raven any? What about you? That looks like KFC. Pint, chicken, chips. Yeah, what Tank. pint is that? Uh, it is. This one. Hang about. <laughs> Goose Island. Goose Island's Island. Island. good choice. It is nice. Hoppy as fuck, but very nice. It's kick off fast approaching. Some of the emotions. Yeah. Go on. 
You put Pangal and Bola Bear atmosphere, I think. Oh, this is going to be a good game. What this means to these players. Great start. <laughs> Midway through the first half here at Wembley, it's quite even, quite tight. Both sides have hit the woodwork, but you just can't see a breakthrough coming at the moment. It's not been the best game, but hopefully someone can score to light it up. Still an for now, let's see if it changes. So the deadlock remains at half time. Neither side quite look like breaking through, but there could be an impressive team top from either of them. But it's not too much to report, it's just too close to call right now. Let's hope we can get a winner, not have to go to extra time. Half time, nil nil. Well, boys, what do we think so far? It's been alright. Not the best game. What do you think so far, boys? Alright. Very lovely. Yeah. Ball has been in the air for most of the game. Hopefully they can get us into the net. Down there, there he is, England legend Stuart Pearce. That's a sighting. Midway through second half, it remains eventless. I don't know how 25 minutes have passed because the square root of sod all has happened. Dave, I... uh... Newport got themselves a lot of good positions and the final ball has just been off every single time. Yeah, I have... Oh, there are the chances. I have a feeling we're seeing extra time, probably penalties too, if so. Still, Give no, no. Pens. Yeah, at least someone will bloody score, hopefully. <laughs> With only 10 minutes to go, we finally had the deadlock broken. Across came in, Kai Waters has headed in at the near post, coming in off the far post. At long last, the deadlock broken. I didn't think it would happen. Last Scott take the lead, 1-0. The 10 minutes to snatch a trophy off the holders. time in a tight game and it is Ascot who snatched the trophy from the holders Newport Pecknell and for the first time in their history they have won the FA Bars. Congratulations to them, very surely they will lift the trophy. It wasn't a great game, there's a moment that will live long in the history of Ascot United. They celebrate behind me and soon they should lift the trophy that they have deserved high in the air. The winners of the 20 So part one of non-league final day is complete. Congratulations, Lascott United. Commiserations to Newport Packle. Both sets of sports were superb. It's a great advert for non-league, this. Congratulations again. We've had a lot of fun. On to the next game. Raven Eddie, anything to say? It's all right. It was all right. Was a bit, a bit away, but... The game sucks, <laughs> but the outcome's good. At least there was a goal. We shall see you in the next one coming up. Gateshead against Halifax in the FA Trophy final. We'll leave it to Royal Ascot to see us out. Congratulations once again to the Azuzu FA Bars